Hello and welcome, this is Noah with Nomad Gaming, and we are here with an introductory video for the Marvel Champions LCG, which is a living card game produced and distributed by Fantasy Flight Games. Today we are going to address a common question for new players, what do I need to play and how do I get into this game? As you begin your journey into Marvel Champions, it's important to have a place to go for insight and information, so subscribe to our channel to keep up to date on the latest news, strategies, and gameplay for Marvel Champions. Now is a great time to join the Marvel Champions community with hot new releases like Black Widow, Doctor Strange, and Hulk coming out through the summer and you definitely will want to get in and be ready for the release of the Rise of Red Skull campaign later this fall. We all come to this game with a different background. Perhaps you've played collectible games, minis, or other Marvel board games. Marvel Champions is distributed in a format known as the Living Card Game or LCG. Other successful games which have used this format include the Netrunner LCG, Game of Thrones, L5R LCG, Lord of the Rings, and Arkham Horror the Card Game. The distinguishing factor about LCGs is that they are sold in fixed non-randomized products. Each package contains a known set of cards for the game, there is no rare chasing or fluctuating secondary market, and every player theoretically has access to the same exact pool of cards. Marvel Champions is also cooperative, meaning that you and fellow players will work together to complete scenarios which are essentially complex puzzles that use elements of a card game to create a unique play experience each time through. The base set or initial product are called core sets. You can see the Marvel Champions core set on the screen here. One great element which has been pr improved with Marvel Champions is that the core set contains full play sets of every card in the initial release, including multiple unique cards which can only be played one per deck so that you and your friends can all play the same stuff. In the past, LCG players would often have to purchase multiple core sets to get a full set of, play of key player cards, but this has been changed with this product. As we discussed, the initial product for this game is the core set. It includes playable cards for five heroes and supports cooperative, simultaneous play for up to four players. It comes with three different villains and their associated scenarios and includes modular villain or encounter sets for customizable play experiences. Out of the box, you have pre-built Captain Marvel and Spider-Man decks, but the rules printout and supplement included with the product also provide pre-designed lists for playing with the other three heroes, Black Panther, Iron Man, and She-Hulk, using the cards and included with the core set. The player side experience can be expanded with hero packs which include playable pre-built decks for that hero. Each pack introduces new player cards to the game and expands the elements of customization and strategy available to our players. Once you have mastered the challenges of the core set scenarios, there are also scenario pack expansions which add new challenges to take on. The scenario packs do not include player cards but have added new elements and fun to the game. In fall of 2020, we will see the first large expansion for the Marvel Champions LCG, which will come in the form of a campaign expansion, the Rise of Red Skull. This box is set to include two playable hero decks. Those will be Spider-Woman and Hawkeye, new scenarios, and villains. The core set is going to cost you about $60 US, but if you know someone who already has a core set, you don't always have to buy in at that price. You are welcome and encouraged to join the game for free by using a friend's card pool, but when the itch hits you to own and customize your own deck, hero packs are where it is at. As noted, these decks are playable out of the box. Yes. You will be limited to the aspect pairing that FFG has chosen, more explanation on that in another video, but you can jump right in after just a shuffle and maybe even a little bit of sleeving. As of May 2020, there are three current hero packs scheduled to re with scheduled releases in June, July, and August. By the time this video goes live, the Black, I'm sorry, the Black Widow hero pack should be available in the U.S. During their recent live Q&A video, FFG announced that they have 20 more hero packs ready for release and in the queue. How exciting is that? Alright, so you know what the game is like and what you need to play, but where on earth can you get this fabulous product? Of course, Fantasy Flight Games sells the product direct from their website. Many players choose third-party vendors or local game stores to get their product as well. One especially convenient method is a subscription service like the one offered and provided by the folks over at Team Covenant, where they will automatically charge you and ship new products as it releases. Other options include big box retailers like Barnes & Noble or GameStop, and of course, everything you need in life can be purchased on popular websites like Amazon and eBay. So. Where do you go from here? 
Well, we are producing a gameplay guide to help you get started, so check that out on the channel in just the coming weeks. There's also a great community which has developed around this game that includes Facebook groups, Reddit, and other content creators, and of course, top quality content from the game's designers over at Fantasy Flight Games. While the game can be played solo, my mode of choice, the community is a great place to engage, get new ideas, and share your experience with Marvel Champions LCG. I look forward to seeing you out there, and hope that you'll join our fun game. This is going to close out our introductory video for the Marvel Champions LCG. We have more great content for beginners coming down the pipeline, so stay tuned until next time. Let's go game!